by how many times? 81 times. Into 40, right? You have a 0 last digit? 1 into 4 ends with? From this, we have to subtract 80. Answer ends with? Third option. 23 square by 23? How much? 23. Right. Next. 12. 56 times. 23 plus 6, 56. 79 goes to right hand side, becomes minus 79. 13 square, minus 79. Fifth option. Right? 55 percent. 50 percent plus 5 percent? 50 percent. Plus 32. How much? 352 goes to right hand side and becomes 324. That is what percent turns 1620? 10%? Double? 320? 10% double in the sense? Right. Next. 1 plus 4? 5 minus 2? 3. Right. Fractions. 2 by 3 can be written as 4 by 6? Minus 1 by 6. 3 by 6. And the other fraction? 2 by 5. LCM 30. 3 fives. 6 twos. Which is 27. Simplified form. And integer? 3, 9 by 10. Under root of 23, 0, 4. 48. Less than 50, right? Right. This is minus 28. How much? 140 by root x is equal to 20. Root x is equal to 140 by 20. 7. x is? 49. Minus x goes to the other side. 162 comes to left hand side. Integer, right? So we have a decimal here. 0 0.29, 0 0.68. Ends with? 0. 7, 7. First, third, fourth. Eliminated. Number before decimal is different, right? Let's concentrate that. 6 plus 9. And 162 comes to left hand side and becomes a negative number. 5 minus 2. Answer ends with 3.77. Second final. Right? 15. 65 times. 27. 2 times 54, 108, that is 4 times, correct? Minus x goes to the right hand side, right hand side number comes left hand side, is that okay? 65 into 24 ends with 0, 11 cube ends with 0 minus 1 answer ends with how many are there? 2 options are there, correct? So now answer is either first or fifth, correct? 65 into 24 from that we have to subtract 1331 yes is it a 3 multiple product is 3 multiple from that you are subtracting non 3 multiple answer non 3 multiple can it be first option can it be first option no fifth final 3 multiple minus non 3 multiple answer must be non 3 multiple first cannot be your answer Divided by x goes to right hand side. Right hand side number will come to left hand side denominator. Correct? 125 how many times? Answer. 25. 40% of this fellow. 10% double double. 10%. Double. Double. 256. How do you get 35%? 25% plus 10%? 25%. One fourth. 3. 3. 20. 1 fourth kada. Plus 10 percent. 128. These values goes to right hand side. Minus x will come to left hand side. That means from 1386 we have to subtract some of all these numbers. So let's verify last digit verification. 6 plus 0 plus 8 ends with. So this goes to right hand side and answer must end with. How many? 
second right this value goes to right hand side becomes minus matladali 36.4 into 1 and 1/2 3 by 2 into 3.4 to how many times 1.7 times right okay so let's verify last digit verification this is integer matladali forget about decimal for some time we'll consider decimal later four threes ends with 2 2 into 7 ends with 4 so if you subtract 4 from integer answer must end with multiple options are there so nothing can be done we have to solve chalo forget about decimal 3 17 times ideally that is 5.1 only 36.4 5.1 times 5 times of this number then we'll add 0.1 times is that okay 10 times is 364 Five times is one eighty two. One time is thirty six point four. Point one times in the sense three point six four only. That means total we have to subtract one eighty five point six four. Enter one eighty five point six four subtracted from integer. That means answer must end with nine point three six only. Five minus five point six four. Answer must end with nine point. How many? only one minus x goes to the other side man atladali 225 will come to left hand side and becomes a negative number already this is a negative fellow both together 277.30 sum of both the positive numbers 277.37 difference 0.07 fourth option minus 625 goes to the other side under root value 25 and becomes plus right plus 25 already we have 5 under root 289 17 how much is this 85 plus 25 110 into x which is in numerator or in denominator numerator so that will be there as it is right so take other numbers to right hand side first divide it by 216 goes to the other side 4 into 216 1272 by 53 goes to the other side and it becomes into 53 by 1272 correct here it is a three multiple and here also we have a three multiple let's first cancel it with 3 72 comes here 424 comes here correct in numerator 72 is there which is a nine multiple in denominator 424 it is not even a three multiple so answer must be how many are there only one 13560 divided by both the numbers comes in denominator and multiplication correct I don't want to go with twelve cancellation, eight cancellation, and all. Let's see, twenty-four eight times. How much is that? One ninety-six. Correct. Approximately two hundred. One ninety-two. Ah, one ninety-two. Approximately two hundred. How many two hundreds are here? Approximately six or seven. Let's calculate seven times of this number. Can I treat this fellow as two hundred minus eight? Seven times in the sense, fourteen hundred minus seven eight times, which is fifty six. Thirteen forty four. Matla dali. Thirteen forty four in the sense seven times. Thirteen forty four subtracted from thirteen fifty six. How much is there? Twelve. And then is zero. One twenty by one ninety two. Do you have any more times? That means you'll get seventy point something. Go to options. Yes, one one by four comes left hand side. Consider integer five plus four, nine minus one. Answer should be eight. There eight or something else more, right? Go to options. Only one. 
A certain number of men could finish a piece of work in 72 days if there were 21 men less. That means how many are there? Initially X people are there. Now 21 less we have. They would have taken 54 more days. So with respect to days, initially we have 72. Then we have 54 more days. That is 126. Correct? Cancellation with... Uh, 6, 12 times, 21, cancellation with 3, 4, 7. That means days ratio is 4 is to 7. Then efficiency ratio must be, initially we have 7 parts, now we have 4 parts. Efficiency decreased by, and which is equal to how many men? That means 3 parts is equal to 21. 3 how many times is 21? Initial number of men are efficiency 7 part 7 7 49. Followed. AB started a business by investing 16,800 and 21,600 respectively. After two months, he joined them with an investment equal to three fourth of B's investment. B's investment was 21,600. Matla if at the end of 10 months the total profit earned was 16,585, C share. Right? When you see their investments, they are having two zeros common yes. and both are six multiples? Yes. Six. Two times. Six. Eight times. Six. Three times. Eighteen. And then six times. Again, you can go with cancellation, right? Four, four cancellation, but, 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 we have to calculate 3 4 of which number B. So B must be 4 multiple. Already we have 36 which is a simplified form and it is a multiple of 4. So no more simplifications again. Let's write numbers as it is. Is that okay? What is 1 fourth of this number? 9. 3 fourth? So C's investment is 27. Is that okay? When did C join? After 2 months. When did they shared profit? That means business happened for 10 months only. And C is not there for 2 months. He will be there for? Cancellation with 4. 7. 9. 2. Again 2 cancellation. And then 5. Now 35 parts. 45 parts. 27 parts. Total how many parts we have? 107. 16,585 is divided into 107. Question is about C share which is 27 parts into 27 into 27. 9 multiple? In denominator do you have 9 multiple? Answer must be 9 multiple. Can it be first option? No. Second? Third? Yes. Fourth? Yes. Fifth? No, when you observe third and fourth options, because you need to decide one among those two, correct? Observe those two options, the difference is third option is 11 multiple. Fourth option is not 11 multiple. Agreed? Come to your numerator, 16,585. Correct? Is that 11 multiple? Can your answer be 11 multiple? If not, this fourth final answer. Done. 58 people attended a concert. Tickets for children were to be sold for 18 rupees each. Tickets for adults were sold 26 each. If 1340 was collected in ticket money, how many children attended the concert? Right. So, allegation is one way. Equation method is another way. And then, out of all, the most beautiful is reverse method. Reverse method will work. As the question is about how many children are there, we'll start with there are no children at all. If children are not there, all are adult only. If all are adult, how much is charged from each adult? 26. Like that we have 58 people. So amount to be collected is 58 into 26. Correct. Can we take this number as 60 minus 2? 26 6 times. 156. 60 times this much. Correct. Minus 2 times in the sense 52. That means we are supposed to get 15008 if all are 
adult but how much is collected in the given in the question 13 how much we got 15 zero eight how much more we got 168 rupees more we got correct what exactly is the reason for getting 168 more because children were converted to adult if it there is only one child from one child how much we will collect 18 if they were converted to adult how much we get 26 if one child is converted to one adult instead of 18 rupees we will sell we will get 26 how much more amount we are getting if there is one conversion we'll get eight more like that we have 168 more how many children were converted in the sense by eight which is 21 final answer there are 21 children which were converted and this is the most beautiful method for this question if you want to calculate using linear equation method x children are there amount collected from them is x into 8 and out of 58 if x children are there remaining people are 58 minus 6 and these people are adult from adult each we are charging 26 rupees and the total money mentioned in the question is 1340 you need to solve the equation to get the answer that is not suggestible over the length of the rectangle is increased by 15 percentage and the breadth increased by 10 percent what is the percentage change in the area of the rectangle area of the rectangle in the sense length into breadth right so for area if there is increase in length it directly affects area if there is change in breadth that is also directly affecting our area so i will choose my area as 10 percentage 100 percent 100 percentage is area that is what i am taking is that okay length increased by 15 percent then it directly affects area then area also increases by 15 percent and then breadth increased by 10 percent that also directly affects in area 10 percent increase in the sense 11.5 increase which is 126.5 initial area was 100 but now it is 126.5 increased by 26.5 followed we are starting area as 100 percentage you don't have to take length as 100 breadth as 100 area is equal to 10,000 length increased by 115 breadth becomes 110 and then it becomes how much you need to calculate you'll get 12,650 increased by 2650 out of 10,000 again increases 26.5 percent so this much lindy simplification is not required you can simply go with a plus b plus a b by 100 a value 15 b value 10 plus a b by 100 150 by 100 26 plus 1.5 26.5 if a single value changes for two times to calculate overall change we use a plus b plus a b by 100 this is what you have probably have learned in which chapter percentages similar formula there is one more formula with a small difference do you know that in the same format you'll have one more formula Amma? a plus b minus when do you use this when do you use this to calculate single discount when you are given successive discounts when you are given successive discounts a comma b to calculate single discount we'll use that a plus b minus a b by 100 if a single value changed for two times like salary increased by first a percentage then b percentage then overall change a plus b plus a b by 100 right two cars started from the same point in opposite direction car a towards north and car b towards south car a started at 7 am and traveled at a speed of 48 km per hour b started at 8 30 traveled at a speed of at a certain speed if at 3 pm car a and car b were 657 kilometers apart what is the speed of car b okay first it, car started at and they both met they both were a difference of 657 kilometers after 3 p.m. right 
from 7 am to 3 pm car a was in journey yes or no for how many hours for how many hours eight hours and whose speed is 48 km per hour 48 km per hour and together distance covered by car a is 48 into a yes to this if you add car b distance then total must be equal to 657 or other way if i subtract distance covered by car a from total distance 657 this is going to be distance covered by car b yes or no car b started at what time and till 3 pm how much gap we have in terms of time six and a half hours come on this is the distance covered by car b in six and a half hours per hour it is divided by six and a half i'll write six and a half as 13 by 2 that comes to numerator 48 times 50 times minus 2 times 50 times of 8 400 minus 2 times 16 and 400 minus 16 3 84 subtracted from 657 last digit 3 65 minus 38 27 into 2 by 13 26 into 2 52 amma 21 kada right yes 21 into 2 42 over the simple interest on certain sum of money for seven years at 12 percent per annum is 7 38 simple interest for seven years at 12 percent per annum what percent is that which is equal to 38 one percentage is by 84 had the interest rate been three percent less what would have been the simple interest on the same sum of money for four years for how many years okay now i don't want to calculate no we have to calculate there is no other way 3864 which is 84% 1 percentage is this much correct now rate of interest reduced by 3% then it becomes 9% and for how many years for 4 years in the sense 36% only that's what we need to calculate numerator 3864 is it a 9 multiple Is it a 9 multiple? At least 3 multiple? In denominator, do you have 9 multiple? 3 multiple? That means 3 multiple gets cancelled, right? But still in numerator, you have 36, which is a 9 multiple. Before going to that, let's verify last digit and then we'll go to 9 multiple. Okay? 4 into 6 ends with? Denominator? 4 into which number ends with 1? Ends with 4 either 1 or 6 so answer must end with either 1 or 6 only one option final if couple of options are there second weapon will come to picture which is that 9 multiple got it Maya sells an article which costs her 560 to Jack at a profit of 25 percentage Jack then sells it to Manish making a profit of 15 percentage on the price he paid to Maya how much money does Manish pay Jack? Okay. Maya sells an article which costs her 560 rupees to Jack at a profit of 25 percentage. So Maya sells it to Jack at a price 25 percent, right? 25 percent profit in the sense one fourth. What is one fourth? 140. Then Maya sells it to Jack at 700 rupees, and then. Jack sells it to Manish at a profit of 15% and the price he paid to Maya. How much he paid? On 700 only he is getting 15% profit? 10%? 70. 5%? Both together? 
that means he is selling it to manish at 805 rupees how much manish paid to jack jack sold it to manish or manish purchased from jack one and the same right answer 805 jack manish kamadanna manish jack degar konadanna edena okate kada hmm the total price of seven trousers and four shirts is 2180 the total price of six shirts is 300 more than the total price of three trousers what is the total price of seven shirts okay right so now the price of six shirts is 300 more than three trousers six shirts price is equal to three trousers plus 300 correct correct we have 2180 rupees that is the price of seven trousers and how many shirts so according to this way i would like to calculate four shirts price here okay 6 and 3 what is the relation 4 and half of that two trousers plus 6 and 300 what is the relation 50 times 450s so i can write four shirts price as two trousers plus 200 in place of four shirts let us write this fellow already seven trousers are there and this is here four shirts is equal to two trousers plus 200 correct seven trousers plus two trousers plus 200 goes to right hand side and it becomes 1980 correct 9 2 2 0 trouser price is equal to this much matladali now the question is about seven shirts if i want to calculate seven shirts price i need to know one shirt price right what is price of two trousers 440 plus 200 640 is equal to how many shirts price then one shirt is equal to by 4 now we want seven shirts that is into seven only 4 160 times into seven answer ends with 20 first option final 167 times 160 as 0 i'll write 0 6 into 7 42 ends with 220 over rajneesh percentage is twice nitish percentage that means they both are in the ratio 2 is 2 1 after 6 years rajneesh age will be half of ajay's age at that time if 13 years ago ajay's age was 41 years old what is nitish percentage we have rajneesh nitish and ajay now the question is about percentage and information regarding after 6 years 13 years back ajay's age was 41 13 years back it was 41 then what is percentage 41 plus 13 which is 54 after 6 years ajay will be 60 years old after 6 years rajneesh will be half of ajay's age at that time that means 30 then percentage of rajni must be 24 and nitish percentage is half of that which is 12 because the ages are in the ratio 2 is to 1 question is about nitish present age 12 final answer yes the ratio between three angles of a quadrilateral is 947 the value of the fourth angle of the quadrilateral is 80 one of the angle is 80 then sum of remaining angles must be 200 and that is divided in the ratio 9 4 7 twenty parts right then each part is equal to 14 to get one of the angle each angle each must be multiplied with 14 Nine times of fourteen, one twenty-six. Four times fifty-six. Seven times 
98. These are four angles of the quadrilateral. What is the difference between largest and third largest angle? Largest is 126. Second largest? Third largest? 80. That means we were asked to calculate the difference between those two numbers. How much is that? 46. Number of laptops manufactured by five companies during five months. Matlad and D. Remember, I didn't expect yesterday. Adhan yes call together. Statistics of a survey on food items preference of the conducted on a sample of 30,000. Any particular question, anyone? Sure. Right. Go on, PO. 18 men complete a piece of work in 13 days. 27 women complete the same piece of work in 8 days. What is the respective ratio between amount of work done by 26 men in one day and 36 women in one day? Yes? Right. Okay. Last class lo okalaga jesam. Gurtunda? X men Y days, Y men X days. Adi gurtu ni keda? Ipin ko laga chadam. If 18 men can do it in 13 days, one man can do it in 18 into 13. One day work of one man is 1 by 18 into 13. How many men are there? 26 men work is equal to this much. And then 27 women can do it in 8 days. One woman can do it in 27 into 8. One day work of one woman is equal to 1 by 27 into 8. How many women are there? 36. 2 times? 9 times? 3 times? 12 times? 3, 2. 1 is to 3 by 2 in the sense that is 2 by 3 only. Ratio 2 by 3 direct. Okay. Last class, lo days le calculate chesam. Now, we will do one day work. In days, we will do one day work. 26 men are there. That's what we need. If 18 men can do it in 13 days, 13 men can do it in 18 days. 26 men can do it in 9 days. Right? This is about days. 27 women can do it in 9 women can do it in 24 days. Women one third aite. Days three times hote ya? Come on. Women half aite. Days double. Women one third aite. Three times. Idi one x aite. X times hote di. Aun na? Ikkada 27 women unna ru. Mane ki question lo 36 women adi gair. Ardham hote unda. E rendit ki 9 multiple common ka abatti factor 9 ki dhiske lehen. So, 9 women can do it in 20. But how many women are there in question? So, 36 women in the sense, women are becoming 4 times, then days becomes 1 fourth, that is equal to 6. Days ratio, simplified form, then efficiency ratio, adding in the efficiency ratio, 2 is to 3. This is another way. Kakpata X, Y, Y, X, I change item Ravali. Others the fingertips. Lay than one day work concept. Okay, now exam law time Kedi Gutasa, they said. Ladies are and Tamawala Kadu either Wokate Jepu and Wokate Jepta. Wokate Jepna, multiple lag Jepuna. Subject nets kunte brain baga panyasada. Matlad Roo. Baga nets kunte brain cancer lanti diseases e on nostaya. Lady Gada. Atlant Pramada and Lady Gada. So we can learn. You have to learn. 
so try to get more information too many methods so that's how you can increase your subject knowledge then you'll have confidence today when you ask yourself are you ready for the exam your sixth sense will give you answer you don't need any per second person ever occur la ask yourself you know the work done how much effort you have made so far to prepare your competitive exam too many people are applying with your existing knowledge ask yourself are you ready for the exam and is your effort knowledge subject knowledge is sufficient to clear the prelims exam as well as mains exam and then getting the job ask yourself your sixth sense will give you one answer and that is right meek litmus test lagi edi akkarla first judgment mee ninche vastadi mee sixth sense e istadi adi yes ani eppudu daaka cheptado appudu varaku chadukuntene povali practice chestunnunde vellali ardham ayinda majjilo bank kottaru evaro appointment icharu raja అపాయింట్మెంట్ ఇచ్చారు రాత్రి ఫోన్లు కట్ చేస్తూ ఉన్నారు మెసేజ్లకు రిప్లై ఇవ్వట్లేదు వాళ్ళని వెళ్ళి సవర్ తీయాలి వెళ్ళటము గిఫ్ట్లు కొనిపెట్టటం సర్వనాశనం అయిపోతారు ఎందుకు పనికి రాకుండా పోతారు చదువుకుంటూ ఉండాలి ఆటోమేటిక్గా వెనక అన్నీ ఫాలో అవుతూ ఉంటాయి ట్రస్ట్ మీ నన్ను నమ్మండి మంచి ఉద్యోగం తెచ్చుకోండి అప్లికేషన్లో వర్ష పెట్టి వరదలాగా వస్తాయి రిజాక్ట్ 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 యాక్సెప్ట్ విల్ థింక్ ఇట్లాంటి స్టేజ్ వస్తుంది అర్థమైందా ఏ సడన్ సామ్ ఈస్ డివైడెడ్ అమాంగ్ పీ క్యూ ఆర్ ఇన్ సచ్ ఎ వే దట్ పీ గెట్స్ నైంటీ ఫైవ్ మోర్ దెన్ వన్ సిక్స్త్ ఆఫ్ ది సామ్ క్యూ గెట్స్ టూ ఫార్టీ లెస్ దెన్ ఫైవ్ ఎయిత్ ఆఫ్ ది సామ్ అండ్ ఆర్ గెట్ సిక్స్ ఫార్టీ ఫైవ్ వట్ ఈస్ ది టోటల్ సామ్ ఇన్ వాల్డ్ రైట్ వన్ సిక్స్త్ అండ్ దెన్ వన్ ఎయిత్ ఎల్సిఎం ట్వంటీ ఫోర్ పార్ట్స్ last class we tried with multiplication rule i guess 24 parts 3 multiple answer must be 3 multiple and all the options are 3 multiples avuna kada so we'll have to calculate there is no other way right so p gets 95 more than 16th of the sum 16th of the sum how much is that four parts and he is getting 95 more than that q gets 240 less minus 240 240 less than what 58 what is 1/8th of total 3 parts 58 5 3 is 15 then there is a third person also when you add everything for all three members that must be equal to 24 parts in terms of parts already we have 19 and to that five more parts negative number minus 145 matladali to that to make it zero if you add 145 sum of three numbers is equal to exact 24 parts only that means third person is getting this much matladali which is mentioned as 645 145 goes to the other side five parts 500 24 parts i pin over 40 chapleda a started a business after 6 months from the start of the business bc joined the respective ratio between investments of a b c was 2 3 4 if a share in annual profit was 230 more than b's share what was total annual profit investment share is in the ratio 2 3 4 a started b joined after 6 months b and c will be there for and a will be there for and no more cancellation 4 3 4 correct and difference between b c a b share is one part which is equal to 230 and total profit is 11 parts into 11 correct answer must end with 30 how many options obvious ga third e kada fourth ete first ete kadu kada it will not be in 3000 something it will be in 2000 only 
Next. 12 liters of pure water was added to a vessel containing 54 liters of pure milk. Yes. Total how much quantity we have? Total. 22 liters of resulting mixture was then sold. Then how much is remaining? 44. Out of 66, if 12 liters is taken out, can I say one third is taken out? One third. That means one third water goes out. One third milk goes out. Correct. What is one third of 12? 4. 4 goes out. Remaining. So water is 8 liters. What is one third of 54? 18. 18 goes out. Remaining. 36. Which is milk. This is the remaining quantity. Correct. Continue. And some more quantity of pure milk and water added in the respective ratio. 7 is to 1. 7 parts of milk, 1 part of water added. If the resultant ratio of milk and water in the vessel is 5 is to 1. So it is in the ratio 5 is to 1. What was the quantity of milk added in the vessel? Milk added in the vessel. That's what the question about. Yes. So let's see. 7 parts. That's what we need to calculate. Answer must be 7 multiple. All the options are 7 multiples. Let's see one more thing. After adding 7 parts to the number 36, it has to be multiple of 5. That means to this number, you need to add a number which is ending with either 9 or a 0 uh, or 4. And then uh, 5 multiple ends with 0 or 5. 36 plus how much will give you 0? Number ends with 4. 36 plus how much will give you number ends with 5? That means answer must end with either 4 or 9. Correct. How many options are there? Only 1. Let's see. If 7 parts is equal to 14, what is 1 part? 2. Am I right? Now total milk? Total milk. 50. Total water? Is the ratio 5 is to 1? Second 14 final answer. Cut it. Otherwise, you'll have to write a step like this. 36 liters of milk we have. To that, 7 parts added. 8 liters of water. To that, 1 part is added. And finally, ratio is 5 is to 1. You need to simplify this. Get the what value of 1 part. Then after, 7 parts. Yes. Instead, we verified 7 multiple. And after addition, it must be 5 multiple. That's what we verified. The present age of Hari is equal to Greg's age 6 years ago. From this, what can be derived? What can be our conclusion? Their age difference is 6 years? Your present age is equal to my age 6 years back. That means our present age is difference is? Any time age difference must be 6 years? 3 years hence the respect to ratio was given Greg and then Hari even after 3 years also difference must be 6 years in terms of parts difference which is 6 years 1 part 7 parts 5 parts Hari's present age Hari will be 15 years old after 3 years then present age in the sense we have to subtract 3 and answer 12 The present respective ratio of curved surface area to the total surface area of the cylinder is 9 is to 16. The curved surface area is mentioned and the question is about height. Right. Curved surface area to the total surface area. Curved surface area formula. 2 pi r h. Total surface area. 2 pi r into r plus height. And the ratio. 9 by 16. 9 parts and then 16 parts. 2 pi r, 2 pi r gets cancelled. Height is equal to r plus height is equal to 16. Then radius is equal to 1584 is curved surface area. 2 pi r h. 7, 7 gets cancelled. Matla dali. 9 once. 68, 7 times, 54, 6 times, 22, 8 times, 
2 4 times p square is equal to 4 p is equal to 2 height is equal to 9 parts which is equal to 18 tick mark chusara when I see this first statement I know that 2 pi r in numerator and denominator gets cancel what is left in numerator height height is equal to how many parts so 9 multiple go to options only one 9 multiple done yes a person has to travel from P to Q in a certain time traveling at a speed of 8 km per hour he reaches 45 minutes late while traveling at a speed of 12 km per hour he reaches 10 minutes early what is the distance from P to Q okay what is speed in first case second case speed ratio if speed ratio is 2 is to 3 time ratio must be time decreased by how many parts and one part is equal to time difference in first case and second case first case it is 45 minutes late plus 45 x axis 0 late positive 45 correct second case 10 minutes early minus 10 plus 45 difference 50 so one part is equal to 55 time taken in first case is equal to three parts which is equal to 3 into 55 which is 165 minutes now the question is about distance distance in the sense speed into time speed in first case 8 time in first case minutes converts to hours by 60 correct Matladali. in numerator 165 is there is that 11 multiple answer must be 11 multiple go to options only one 44 final answer 4 2 times 4 15 times 15 11 times answer 22 kilometers over 5200 partly invested in scheme A 20% per annum compound interest compounded annually for 2 years how much interest we will get 44% partly in scheme B a 12% per annum simple interest for 5 years how much interest we will get 60% both the schemes earn equal interest that means 44% of X is equal to 60% of Y 4 11 times and then 15 times x by y is equal to 15 by 11 how much was invested in scheme a in scheme a how many parts we have scheme y both together both together investment was 2200 which is divided into 26 parts and we were asked to calculate x value which is into 15 26 200 times into 15 3000 A bought certain quantity of mangoes at a total cost of 2100 he sold 27th of mangoes at 5% loss if A incurs overall loss of 10 percentage, at what percent loss did A sell the rest of the items? 2 seventh, 2 parts over, 5 parts, 5 tenths, 50, 5 5, 10 more, 60, by 5, 12, first option. 5 into 10, 2 into 5, divided by 5, 60 by 5, 12. This is what the simplification I did. How many of you understood that? Raise your hand. How many of you have understood my step? Raise your hand. Only one. Only one. I think in last class I have told you already. Imagine like this. Visualize like this. What, what fractional quantity he sold? Denominator. That means I will assume we have seven parts. Overall we are expecting 
so if there is 10 laws on each and every item overall that is equal to 10 come on these two already sold out forget about those for some time remaining how many are there on each we need to 10 the total that is 5 into 10 yes or no this is going to be your final answer if on first two items there is 10 percent loss but on first two items what is made five percent loss but what we are expecting that means we need five more percentage extra already it is only five percent profit correct but we need ten percent that means on each we need five extra like that how many are there that means we need extra two into five right this much prof uh, this much loss is expected now and we need to get this much loss by selling how many by selling how many parts divided by five out of seven parts two parts already over remaining five parts 60 by 5 12 final answer if you can visualize like this one step is sufficient otherwise come on 2 7th already sold how much is remaining and the total everywhere it is loss only so you don't have to concentrate on positive thing or negative thing you can directly follow overall 10 percent loss expected on 2 7th 5 percent loss was made on remaining 5 seventh, how much is there? Left hand side denominator 7 taken common, goes right hand side becomes 70. 2 into 5 goes to right hand side, which is equal to 5x. Then x is equal to divided by 5, which is 12. Otherwise, 7 items, 2 items already sold. Overall, we are expecting 10% loss. On each 10, 10, 10, 10 is required. 2 7th sold out, forget about these two. On these 5 items, each we need 10, 10, 10. Total? Total 50, remember. On these two, 10% loss is expected. But what percent loss is made? 5%. That means extra 5 more we need. 5 on this, 5 on this. Both together? On these 5? 50 plus 10? We need to get 60 loss, but we need to sell only? 5 items, 60 by 5, 12 final. Ardhamainda, you need to visualize this. If we have that capacity, it will be easy. A bag contains 4 red, 6 yellow, 2 pink ball. Total how many are there? 1 ball is drawn at random. That is 12C1. Probability that it is either red or yellow. How many red are there? 4. How many yellow are there? Out of those 10, you can get any 1. 10C1 by 12 c1 5 by right number of appeared candidates percentage of appeared candidates who qualified same for state l there are two states total appeared candidates those who have given the exam percentage of appeared candidates who got qualified qualified candidates percentage right matla dali so these percentages calculated on respect to numbers, correct? What is the difference between number of qualified candidates from state L in 2019 and that in 2020? Qualified candidates difference in L, L, second state, right? 2019 and 2020, 2019 and 2020. This is what we need, correct? Right, so first and basic verification what I do is, 30 percent 3 multiple, 39 percent 3 multiple, difference 3 multiple, come to options. Can it be first, second, third, fourth, fifth, two options are there, correct? Now I will verify last digit verification. 39 percent in the sense, 39 into 4, come on, 400 is more than 240. 39 is more than 30 so difference in the sense it has to be largest minus smallest and this is the largest one matla dandi 30 percent in the sense 10 percent into 3 10 percent into 3 difference 9 4 cents with 4 3 cents with answer ends with out of those two options which is ending with 4 84 it has to be 3 multiple and ends with 4. Oh, no. 
If the respective ratio between qualified candidates from state L in 2021 2022 is 9 is to 13, what is the number of qualified candidates from state L in 2022? Okay. In 2022, how many got qualified? 13 parts. If you are comfortable with 13 parts, 13 multiple, you can go and verify it. Otherwise, let's calculate. State L 2021, what person got qualified? That is 7 into 10 percent value, which in terms of number of parts is equal to, but we need to calculate 9 parts is equal to this much, 1 part is equal to by 9. We need 13 parts into 13. 9 how many times? Last digit verification, 7 into 4, 8 into 3, answer ends with how many? Only 1. Total number of appeared, total appeared candidates from state K increased by 100% from 2018 to 19. If the number of qualified candidates from state K in 2018 and 19, both together is 561. Number of appeared candidates from state K in 2018. From 2018 to next year, increased by 100%, they said. That means 200% only? First year, qualified people, 45 percentage. Direct 45. Matladandi. Next year it is 60 percentage but calculated on 200. 120 percent both together 160. That means given number 561 is equal to 165 and the question is about 2018 value which was 100 percent only. Matla Dali. Cancellation with uh, 165 and 11 nundi gada. Matla Dali. 11, 15 times, 11, 50, 1 times, 5, 3 times, 5, 20 is 3, 17 into 20, 3, 40. If the average number of qualified candidates from state K in 2020, 2021, 2022 is 220. Average is 220. For how many years? Then sum is equal to? They are qualified people, right? What is the number of qualified candidates from K in 2020? 2020 in the sense, for other two years we need to subtract data, right? Matla Dali. Right. K in 2021, 50%. 40% of 380, 10% double double, 10% double, 76 double, 150, answer must end with how many, two options are there, correct, from 60 if you subtract 77, answer ends with 83. Out of total number of qualified candidates from state L in 2018, respect to ratio between male and female candidates is 4 is to 3. The number of female candidates qualified from state L in 2018 is 69. What is the number of appeared candidates? Okay, right. How many female got qualified? They are in the ratio 4 is to 3, right? Total how many parts? Which year? State L. 2018 what percentage got qualified and this 35 percentage is divided in the ratio 4 is to 3 where that is divided into 7 parts female are 3 parts correct these many got qualified Auna. and which is equal to mentioned as how much 60 7 that means 15 percentage is 69 1 percentage is 69 by 15 and we need total appeared people. Appeared people in a? Matla Dandi. 100 percentage. 5. 3 times. 20 times. 3. 
ट्वेंटी थ्री टाइम्स फोर सिक्सटी Number of people who travel from Aligarh to Kanpur by train Z M and Y N on six different days: Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Train Z M and then Y N. First, need to prepare the table. Y M, zero to fifty, fifty hundred. So five lines, fifty gap each line. Right, first one, train Y M. One line below three hundred. Two ninety. Next one. Two eighty. Next. Two forty. Next. One eighty. Next. Two hundred and twenty. Two hundred and fifty. Come on. Next. Two hundred and. Next. Next. One forty, one eighty, two hundred eight. Total number of people who travelled by train Y N decreased by what person from Monday to Thursday? Rounded up to two digits after decimal. Monday to Thursday, two sixty becomes one forty. Decreased by, decreased by, one twenty from two sixty percentage into. right options are very close to each other let's calculate 50 percentage which is 130 from that how much you need to subtract what is 1 percent of the denominator double double so if it is 10.4 you need to subtract 4 percent but you don't have to subtract 10.4 right little less than that avna kada that means it would be probably 3.9 something or 3.8 something whatever it is answer must be in 46 point something how many options what do you want the number of people who traveled by train m on sunday is 20% less than the people who traveled by the same train on saturday what is the respective ratio between number of people who traveled on tuesday and those who traveled on sunday by the same train same train in the sense which train m sunday it is 20% less than that on saturday on saturday how much you have saturday 20% less 200 now the ratio is about tuesday and then sunday tuesday 280 sunday 00 can be cancelled both are four multiples seven times five times seven is to five total number of people who travel by both the trains together on wednesday wednesday both the trains together 430 is what person more than total number of people who travel by the both the given trains on friday friday 400 yes right so is what person more than with respect to 400 430 is how much more 30 more upon 400 into 30 by 4 7 and half what is the difference between total number of people who travel by train m on monday and thursday together monday and thursday together 4 70 4 70 difference between this fellow and total number of people who travel by train y n on monday and wednesday monday and wednesday both together 450 so difference between both the numbers 20 what is the average number of people traveling by train y n on tuesday wednesday thursday friday train y n tuesday 
Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. These four, right? Come on. 180, 140. 320, 230, 550. 550 plus 190. Add 200, subtract 10. 550 plus 200. 750 minus 10. 740. For how many days? That is half and half. Half is 370. Again half. 185. Product is 50. Minus 5 minus 10 is the combination. Factors. 5 comma 10 divided by. How much is this? 63. Come on. 7. 9 times. Minus 7 minus 9. Factors. Plus 7. Plus 9. Divided by. This is 2 and a half. 5. This is 2. 1 by 3. And this is? 3 lies in between these two numbers. In between condition. No relation. Product is 45. 45. 5, 9 times. Minus 5. Minus 9. By? Not required. Because for y square also same coefficient. Product? 90. 9 into 10. Minus 9. Minus 10. X is greater than or equal to Y. Product is 35. 5 comma 7. Factors minus 5. Minus 7. Product is 18. 6 3 times. Minus 6 by 2. Minus 3 by 2. Minus 5 minus 7. Minus 3 minus 1 and half. Correct. X is strictly less than y x square is 64 plus r minus 8 y minus 8 whole square is equal to 0 y is equal to 8 x is less than or equal to y. 42 is the product 3 14 times matlab and minus 3 minus 14 70 is the product 7 into 10 minus 7 lies in between these two relation cannot be established you don't need second factor also sure everybody First name data quella. All the values are in percentages. One percentage value is 12. Three multiple. Correct? So in these questions, anywhere, if you are asked to calculate any one particular value or sum of two values or difference of values, answer must be three multiple. Correct? Because one percentage is three multiple. No, no, yes, yes, no. Now football. Football is 24%. Again this is 3 multiple. Already 3 multiple 1 person value and this is also 3 multiple. Product must be cancel. Because 1 percentage is 3 multiple you can directly verify 3 multiple. Required percentage is also again 3 multiple. So answer must be 9 multiple. So this is what you can verify. A group of 60 children, each child plays one or more musical instrument out of sitar, violin, guitar and then harmonium. If there is a word only every time, what do you need? Table. Otherwise, Venn diagram. 13, 1 by 3 percent children play only sitar. 13, 1 by 3, if you convert it, it becomes 40 by 3 percent. What is 40 percent? 24. But we need 40 by 3 percent, right? 24 by 3? 8 people. That means only sitar? 8 people. 20 percent play only violin. 20 percent? 12. 
टेन परसेंट प्ले ओनली हारमोनियम ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंट प्ले ओनली गिटार फिफ्टीन फाइव चिल्ड्रन प्ले सितार एंड गिटार थ्री चिल्ड्रन प्ले सितार एंड हारमोनियम फोर चिल्ड्रन प्ले वायलिन एंड गिटार टू चिल्ड्रन प्ले हारमोनियम एंड गिटार थ्री चिल्ड्रन प्ले सितार गिटार वायलिन रिमाइनिंग विल प्ले ऑल थ्री सितार वायलिन हारमोनियम एंड गिटार टोटल थ्री प्लस टू फाइव प्लस फाइव ओके ट्वेल्व प्लस एट ट्वेंटी प्लस टेन थर्टी प्लस ट्वेंटी वन फिफ्टी वन प्लस थ्री फिफ्टी फोर प्लस फोर रिमाइनिंग वट इज द रेस्पेक्ट टू रेशियो ऑफ टोटल नंबर ऑफ चिल्ड्रन प्लेइंग हारमोनियम एंड सितार रेस्पेक्टिवली हारमोनियम एंड सितार फर्स्ट लेट्स कैलकुलेट हारमोनियम सिक्स प्लस थ्री प्लस टू प्लस टू सो यर फर्स्ट नंबर मस्ट बी थर्टीन हाउ मेनी ऑप्शन आर देर मल्टीपल आर देर नाउ सितार एट प्लस फाइव प्लस थ्री सिक्सटीन प्लस थ्री प्लस टू ट्वेंटी थर्टीन इज टू ट्वेंटी वन हाउ मेनी चिल्ड्रन प्ले सितार जस्ट नो वी कैलकुलेटेड हाउ मेनी ट्वेंटी हाउ मेनी चिल्ड्रन प्ले ओनली सितार एंड आर हारमोनियम बट नॉट गिटार एंड वायलिन यू डोंट नीड गिटार एंड वायलिन यू नीड सितार आर हारमोनियम आर बोथ ओनली सितार ओनली हारमोनियम सितार एंड हारमोनियम एक्सेप्ट दीज थ्री रिमेनिंग विल हैव एदर गिटार आर वायलिन एज अ कॉम्बिनेशन Yes or no? So we just need to pick only these three items. How much is that? Seventeen. Then statement good pet kundi. Sitar only sitar and harmonium or harmonium. That means only sitar, only harmonium, sitar and harmonium. Then meaning adi. Okay na? How many children do not play violin? Do not play violin. Wherever violin is there, let's first identify it. Violin. Twelve plus four. Sixteen plus five. Twenty. If twenty-one are in violin, remaining are not in violin only. Out of total, sixty. Subtract twenty-one. Thirty-nine. otherwise you'll have to add all the remaining values instead of that we are taking how many are playing violin and subtracting from the total this is something like counting male students in a class from the total you can subtract female or you can simply count male same way you can count which are not in violin or you count violin and subtract it from the total okay na what is the difference between number of children playing guitar and violin violin we just got it right how much is that 20 i think guitar also we calculated guitar we calculated no leda led violin but but we did violin right now count guitar 15 plus 5 20 plus 4 24 plus 2 26 plus 3 plus 3 difference so wherever g is there we need to keep counting those values okay na done